In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix Hunt Showdown in 1896 crashing or freezing when opening the map. So this is indeed a Word document with some points, but I'm going to show you everything you need to know on my computer as well, okay? These are just notes so we don't get lost. Now, if that happens to you and your map is freezing while trying to open it, the first thing you can do is turn off all your NVIDIA overlays inside the GeForce Experience. So in case you are using NVIDIA GeForce Experience, like I am over here, you want to turn off all the overlays. And the way you do this is when opening the NVIDIA GeForce Experience, you want to click Settings up here. And then inside Settings, you want to scroll down to where it says In-Game Overlay. Make sure this is turned off so it's grayed out. If it looks like this, so if it's green, just click it and it will turn off. That's it. So that's the first step. We can now close down GeForce Experience. The second thing would be to set your shader cache to 10 gigabytes or more inside NVIDIA Control Panel. Now, the way you do this is again by going down here to search in your Windows taskbar and typing in NVIDIA Control Panel, okay? Now, open it up. And then inside here, when this opens up in a second, there we go, you can see different settings. What you want to do is click here on the left where it says Manage 3D Settings. And then you want to scroll down and look for something that says Shader Cache Size. As you can see, it's over here, about in the middle. And what you want to do is click it and then set it from whatever it is. So for me, it's driver default. You want to set it to 10 gigabytes or even 100 gigabytes if you want to, but I would still recommend 10 gigabytes because that should be enough to fix the issue if it will, okay? Now, that's it. You want to click it and then that's it. You want to then close it down. And then the next thing we can do is to verify the integrity of game files on Steam. And the way you do this is to open up Steam and then you want to open up your library up here. Now you want to look for, of course, your game, okay? So for me, as you can see, I don't have the game, but I'm going to show you the different game. What you want to do is right click on that game, so on your Hunt Showdown game, and then you want to click Properties. In here, what you want to do is click Installed, fi Installed Files here on the left, and click Verify Integrity of Game Files. Then Steam will check the integrity of your game files, and if any files were corrupted during the installation, it will replace them and fix all the issues for you automatically. Now this will usually take only a few seconds, if there's any errors though, and any files have to be replaced, it may take up to a few minutes, but it's very quick. Now once you've done that, you can close this down. Then the next thing is to close Steam Overlay while playing the game. And the way you do this, again, we're going to Steam, you want to click on the Steam icon up left, at the very top, up left, click it and press Settings, and then go to In-Game, which is here at the bottom, and in here, you want to turn off this Enable the Steam Overlay, overlay while in-game, so turn this off, and that's it, okay? Then you want to close this down, and the next thing we can do is to restart our computer, okay? So that's the last thing we can do. We've done pretty much everything you can do to fix this issue, and then you simply want to restart your computer, or you can even restart your computer when that happens and see if that fixed the issue for the time being. Now, I hope this video helped you out, and if it did, please subscribe to the channel and help me out as well.